Okay, if you are using EasyOpt and you want to insert an unsubscribe, opt out, email message to your HTML templates and you're using this particular template here in Salesforce, here's how you insert your message. Actually, I'm not going to create a new one. I'm going to go and use an existing. So let's say that here's the message that you already have, or the email template you already have, and you want to insert your uh, unsubscribe message in the footer of this email. So click on Edit HTML version. Okay. Now go ahead and navigate to the location where it is that you want to insert your, your, your message. So let's say you want to put it at the footer here. So now go ahead and type whatever message you want. Click here or unsubscribe. So what you want to do is type, well, it could be one word, it could be an entire sentence, it could be a paragraph. Whatever you want to appear as the link, go ahead and highlight that. Come up here to the link on the toolbar, click here, and remember that, what do we have here? This message over here, okay? Go ahead and copy this, but all you need to copy and insert here, see how it has the HTTP colon forward slash forward slash, delete that, and now go ahead and paste everything from mail, from mail to, so get rid of the quotation marks, uh, any other brackets, any other symbols, get rid of those. Paste everything after your brackets, starting at mail to, to whatever your subject is, unsubscribe or opt out, put that here, okay? Click on OK, and now there's your link. When, the, when your recipients receive, or excuse me, when they click on that link there, it's going to launch their email application, it's going, and it's going to insert the subject that you define uh, in this process of setting this up. Now, what I like to do is add an additional message. Okay, after So I can put this message here. Now some people like to go ahead and gray this out. Let me see, I want to check, I want to change the font to eight and maybe I even want to change the color here to gray, so it's grayed out, okay? So that's all you have to do. Now when the recipient received this email, here's your message, here's your opt out message. Okay, when they click on that link, it's gonna open their email application it's going to insert the subject line. Here's some instructions for them, and you should be good. All right. So once you've done this, go ahead and save. And now we can actually preview. Go back into HTML edit. And let's preview. And there's your message.